Hi guys, Rob 46 here, welcome yourselves back to MotoGP 23 on the Xbox Series X. Let's continue with career mode, we are off to Le Mans next. There'll be 9 laps in Moto2. Let's head over. So, Acosta is our rival at the moment. And uh, it's going to be dry by the looks of it, which is good. Right, let's head out for qualifying then. Q1. See what we can do. I've got a feeling we're probably not going to make it through to Q2. Remember rightly, in Moto3 around here it was quite difficult. Okay, no one set a time yet. That's not going to count. Thirty six zero. I don't think that's going to be enough anyway. Lost us a load of time. The worrying thing is, Tulovic is getting away. That doesn't bode well for me. It's way too hot in that. 30 9 for Skinner. You're having a joke, aren't you? Thirty six five one point six off, yeah, we're not gonna get through. So thirty four five for Darren Binder, yeah, we're not gonna be there. We're point nine off for fifteenth place. Thirty 
Yeah, 1.1 off of um, 15th. Yeah, we're not going to get there. So we're going to be starting in dead last place. Lucky us. Right, race time then. I don't think we're going to be doing much um, in this race. If they're doing 34s in the race, then yeah, we are going to struggle, but we'll see. Okay, where we go. Make up positions off the start. I mean, they are very weak on their starts, which is going to be helpful. Tries to slow through there. Acosta is my rival at the moment. is where we're going to suffer on this part. The cost was actually a bit too quick through there. Always wide there. Not wide enough though. Okay, sacrificing some fuel to get into the lead. Wrong gear. do with Arbolino getting in front of uh, Acosta. If I remember rightly, in Moto 3 last season, a load of them crashed um, in the leading group during the race, which helped me out position wise. Arbolino was there. Yeah, used to fight. Fight amongst yourselves and just leave me out of it.
Opelino's gonna come through, isn't he? That's wide, he's definitely going to come through now. Or is he? Oh, he was on the grass then. Need to continue making myself as wide as possible because we're on lap four of nine. What a weird way to ride. I'm concerned about getting collected at that corner if they're going in too hot all the time. It's Acosta back in a second now. We've got a much better run out the final corner that time. I think the game has decided it's time for them to start going quicker. We do get on our final corner a bit better than them. So we go back into the lead, but only just for now. Mess that up. Literally between the two of them now. Jake Dixon is here trying to pick up the pieces. Oh, cut the corner a bit there. Not tipping in. Not the best time to look behind you, Arbelino. Eh? 
No, I can't even get the bike stopped. This is a penultimate lap of the race. Should have gone for the medium front. Oh, this front end is moving all over the place now. Okay, we need to go careful with trap limits. Trouble is, we haven't got much fuel left. I think we were what, 6th? 7th. Yeah, no, I don't. So yeah, they were in the 34s and the 35s. And I was in the 36s, so yeah. At least we uh, led for a little bit. 
But yeah, that was a uh, difficult and frustrating race. We're now 38 points behind. Goody. Team Championship, we're fourth. We need some upgrades. Anyway, no Park Fermi or anything. Just straight back. So yeah, we're now 20 points behind um, Acosta. Which isn't ideal. You have a message. Next time, Robert Poise sends the entire race trying to make me fall. I'll go straight to direct, direct, race direction. Yeah, we'll go with that. Okay, Magello will be next. Going to be dry, so that's fine. Okay, let's look at standings for all three categories. So, Moto 3. It is Holgado who leads away from Mazia in second place. Just eight points between them. Uh, Munoz moves up five places to third. Tober up to fourth and Carrasco down to fifth. Moto 2, Arbelino leads from Acosta in second. I'm in third. Ayagura fourth. Lopez in fifth. MoGP, Alicia Spargo leads away from Marquez in second. Nakagami third. Alex Rins in fourth. And Bastianini in fifth. Three Hondas in the top four? No, definitely not. Anyway, guys, that is it from me. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave this video a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel for more content. Shall see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to stay safe, watch, and look after yourselves. See you guys next time. See you.